Hello and welcome to this special education series brought to you by the Bombay Stock Exchange Investor Protection Fund and the Money Mile. Joining me today is veteran stock broker Alok Churiwala, who is also the managing director of Churiwala Securities Private Limited, but a very well known face in the Bombay Stock Exchange broking circles, has represented the Bombay Stock Exchange members as well over his career. Thank you very much, Alok. A pleasure talking to you. Thank you for having me over. Alok, there's been a lot of interest of late in IPOs. And, uh, you know, it's the initial public offer, as we call it. But uh, to help our uh, viewers understand, what is an IPO? Can you explain that to them? Absolutely. In fact, IPO, if we talk in colloquial language, is also new, uh, known as new issue and uh, very popular amongst uh, investors. Earlier, again, uh, I am keeping on talking about what used to happen earlier, only to give the investor a perspective of how uh, things were and what they have changed to. There was something called the Contr controller of capital issues, the office of which decided what an IPO used to be priced at. And that ensured that there was enough money left on the table for the investor. So. Investors always necessarily made money in an IPO. Cut to what has happened now. There was a big clamor from uh, the industry, that is the issuers. They said that uh, why should there be any limitation on the price at which we can offer our shares to the public? Let the buyer beware. Let us decide what our company is valued at, what it is worth at, and the buyer will make a judicious call as to whether they want to apply for this new issue or not. And hence came free pricing. Now, what is an IPO? IPO is merely a company that needs capital offering its shares to the public who it shares its capital with at a price decided by the company and the merchant bankers. This is in a sum and substance what an IPO is. Immediately after this offering is made, Money exchanges hand, shares exchange hand, company gives you the shares, you give your money to the company, then the shares are listed in the market and then normal trading in them begins. Then the price is de uh, decided on the demand and supply that there is in the market. So most of the times we've seen when markets are good, IPOs tend to open much higher than what they've been offered at. And this is exactly what uh, enthuses investors to apply in them. Been a pleasure talking to you. Thank you very much, Alok Churiwala, for joining us and sharing your learnings with our viewers. Thank you. Always a pleasure, Vivek. Thank you so much.